Welcome to Dr. Karen's Math Hacks. Today I'm going to tell you about how to add and subtract numbers in your head. Now we, we can all do one digit numbers, you know, 5 plus 6 is 11. But what about 23 plus 18? Today I'm going to show you how we can do that easily. When we learned to add in school, we were taught to set things up like this and then say 8 plus 3 is 11, put 1 down here, carry the 1, and then add these three numbers to make 41. However, that's not the way our heads work because keeping track of these numbers uses up all our brain space. We only have so many numbers that we can remember at the same time. So there's another way of doing it. We take a, we take a number, I'll take 23, now we're going to be adding 18 to it. So let's add 10 first. Now we can add the 8 and get our 41. It seems that incrementing a number that you already have in your head does not use the same amount of brain space as trying to keep track of that carried 1. So this in general is how I add in my head. We can also use it for three-digit numbers. Let's do um, 349 plus uh, 123. Okay, we start with 349. We add 100, so it's 449. We add the 2 here, so it's 469, and then the 3, so it's 472. We can also use this method with subtracting. So, 23 minus 18. We have 23. We subtract 10 and we have 13. 13 minus 8. Okay, if that's not easy enough to do in your head, you can you can do this trick. Okay? 8 is 5 plus 3. So because 8 is negative, we have a minus 5 and minus 3. That's a 3. So now the 13 here, the 3 there cancels the 3 there. So now we have 10 minus 5. Let's do it again. Um, 45 plus um, 17. Okay, when we're adding 45, 55, 62. Now for subtracting, 45, 35, we take 5 out of the 7 to counter that 5. So we have 30 minus 2 is 28. One more example. Fifty-four plus thirty-seven. Fifty-four plus thirty is eighty-four plus seven is ninety-one. Fifty-four minus thirty-seven. Fifty-four minus thirty is twenty-four. So we have twenty-four minus seven. That's what I have in my head right now. Well, 7 breaks down into 3 and 4. And the 4 will cancel this. So now we have 20 minus 3, which is 17. Play around with this and see how it works for you. I'll be showing another way to do this mentally next week. But that way only works with sevens, eights, and nines. Have a good week. 
If you found this video useful, consider subscribing or hitting the like button. I'll be posting another math hack next week.